I'm standing inside the living area. And you can see from where Edgemont is and Elk Run townhomes where the proximity of this particular condo is. And so from the front doorway, the bedrooms are located to the left and straight ahead, the master's straight ahead, and the guest bath is right here to the right. This is the one that's priced at 545 This one, the bath is not remodeled. This looks fairly... The guest bedroom has twins. You could easily convert that to a bunk. It overlooks the hallway and the stairs, so you would want to have a blind that either came up from the bottom part to let in a little bit of light. They have blackout blinds in here. Nice quality ones, Hunter Douglas. And the master is a really nice size. It fits a king bed in here quite nicely. And the master bath has had a nice remodel. It has a soaking tub, separate shower with seamless doors, really nice tile work. And then two sinks. So from the outside, I'm standing in the ski trail lot. You can see there's the Gandhi right there. The unit I was just in is right here, 223. And 222, the one that's also for sale, is right here. And so the deck is going to be this one. Not quite as big. And then where the ski slope is, is just right through these trees right here. This is the gondola tower. And where the condos are, are right here. And then you can see the renovation that they're doing where you would actually ski in to get or drop your skis off. They're going to put a fire pit there and some other improvements. They've also changed the conference area into more of a owner lounge type area. And I can get you more information on that. There's the base. So I'm next door at B222. This is the one that's for sale for $475. Dollars, four hundred seventy-five thousand dollars. Very similar kitchens. Granite, same type of a view overlooking the ski trail. Parking lot. This one does have a little bit smaller deck, and other than that, it's the pretty much the exact same layout that we were just in. It does look like it has had a new surround put on the fireplace, new stone, and also tile. And these are also similar. And then going down into the bedrooms, and these are the blinds I was referring to in the other place where you can still have privacy and let light in. Twin beds, this one has a blue wall as an accent, and then across the hallway this bath is an original bath. Probably the biggest difference between the two would be the master bath and the other one is totally redone and this one's not. And also this one has green carpet whereas the other one had tan and this one
has a smaller deck, but it also appears to have a new surround from the fireplace. Both are in nice condition. This has a jetted tub and shower combination and then separate toilet area and a double vanity whereas the other one they took that wall out and put the sink there so they would have room for the shower and when you come out of 222 you're looking at the center of the complex there's the water feature down there and the hot tubs and pools over here with the front desk and check-in area.